I welcome you all back to my channel. My name is Aisha. In today's video, I will be showing you how to cut and sew this puffy sleeve. I will be showing you the full details on how to cut it and how to sew it. Thank you all for your support. If you are new to my channel, kindly click on the subscribe button. Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. Happy viewing. I will be cutting out the puffy part of the flay first. This is the short part of the flay. I will be making use of 7.5 for the radius. You measure 7.5 all round to get your radius. And I will be making use of 8.5 for the length of the flay. So you take 8.5 all round to get your length and to get your perfect flay. So I will be making use of 6 inches for the actual length of the flay. I will be making use of 6 inches for the actual length of the flay. And 2 and half for the folding. For me to get that puffy look of the sleeve. I will be cutting it out. This is it. I'll be cutting two pieces of it and placing it on the fabric, the one I've cut, and placing it on the main fabric to cut the second one. This is the long puffy part of the sleeve. I've cut out the two pieces. I will be making use of 13 and half for the length of the flay. You measure 13 and half all round. So you can see 13 and half. You measure it all round for the flay, for the longer flay. I use same radius for both the long and the short flay, which is seven and a half. Your radius determine how puffy the sleeve look and to add enough pleat to it. I've cut out the upper part of the sleeve. You cut this out as lining 3 inches by 10 inches so i'll be using this to turn it at the down aspect you use it to turn it for us to get that uh, puffy look so i'll pleat the edges of the flay on this so that we'll get that puffy look and at the upper part also I use 9 inches by 7.5 inch for the inner of the longer flay. This is the one I will be using to turn the longer flay for us to get that puffy look. This is the upper part of the sleeve. I use 11 inches for the length you the sewing aspect of the sleeve so this is the short flay of the sleeve and this is the longer flay of the sleeve so i'll use the shorter flay first so that we'll be using for the folding in of the flay at the edges here so you come to the center part of your flay this is it so you notch it so what i will be using for the turning of the flay here so I will also notch it. I 
kids you can see the way i pick it you start from your sewing from here and you start giving it pleats I've pleated it, you can see. If you now place it, you stitch it down from here. This way. Open this place. From here. Open this place also. So at this center here so that everything will be equal the mush here also this is it okay so so I will start our swing from there and it's this way See, we are true with really short flea. This is it. You can see it. So now to the other side the shorter two sleeve you can see this is it so end of the sleeve so same thing apply you come to this center part here i will not sheet add it down here so you also come to the main flame I've already notched it here, so I'll come to the down aspect. So I'll notch it at the center, at the down here. So notch it at the center here also. So. It's from here. So we'll sew it downward from here.
so yeah make it equal here so that we are joining his on the line the one we are using to line in it and the main flea so you make it equal you can see you come here you make it equal there so and you start your plates place it this way at the top so and you place it on the lining is it you can see it same thing applies to the other side so I'll be placing it on each other I'll be placing the shorter one on the longer one so this is the short one and this is the long one so you place it you look for where the joining where there is joining at the side so this is the joining for the smaller one at the side and you look for where there is joining at the bigger one so, so you place it on each other so this is it so we place it this way and we start our sewing so we we'll meet at the center so this is it this is it so now i'll be joining a part of the sleeve so now we'll make use of our round sleeve here so the round sleeve i'm using here is 13 and a half so this is the upper part of the sleeve i'm making use of 13 and a half for the round sleeve here so i'll come here And then I will stop my sewing here first, just for me to the down part of the sleeve to it for you to be able to see it. So so you look for the center point. You notch it at the center, here, at the down edges of the upper part of the sleeve. This is it. So I'll be joining. So that's where you join to this side. Where there is joining, so the joining meets here. So. sleeve so i'm done with the two sleeve so this is it you can see so, this is it so i'll be sewing it on the body of the dress i'll be placing how simple it is you can kindly give it a thumbs up if you have any question or suggestion you can drop it in the comment section below kindly subscribe to my channel and make sure it turns on your notification bell so that whenever i upload a new video you will be notified thanks for watching bye